Hi Aries and welcome to your daily reading. I hope you guys are doing amazing today. Thank you for stopping in. So let's go ahead and see what pops up in your message Aries. And I hope you are fantastic. I hope all is well with you. All right, Spirit, please show us here the message for Aries for the day. What do they need to see or acknowledge? Aries daily message. Page of water. A new person enters your life. Could be a water sign. Doesn't have to be. Could be somebody expressing their love or friendship. What is this page of water? The six of wands. The victory, the hero. Somebody's coming in. Um, getting attention. Good news is on the way. Public recognition. Somebody's trying to be seen. They're trying to be recognized. They are a new energy. The wheel of fortune. Good luck. Good fortune. Things are changing for the better. It is Jupiter energy, so it's good luck, good fortune, things changing. The night of air in the past. Somebody was dramatic. They were maybe even impatient. There could have been something happen, some, some news coming in fast. The page of air, somebody who's spying, watching, curious. Um, there could be some rudeness or someone who lacks tact. They are just kind of blunt or childish or immature. Um, future is a night of water. Somebody coming forward with their feelings, their emotions. Your energy is two of pentacles. You're trying to keep things in perfect balance. You could be juggling. Um, you're keeping everything in balance. Um, you're not living in extremes. It's earth sign balance. A person around you is in a five of cups. They're feeling sad or disappointed. They could be missing you, but they could also be feeling regret or remorse. You could be expecting an apology here from someone. Oh, okay. Um, I think here the moon is your fear because it's uncertain. It's when you don't know and you don't have the answers. You have to sort of turn inward and listen to your intuition. You fear the moon. Hopefully you don't fear the moon. The moon is part of the mystery. It actually is a test of your faith. You have to have faith with the moon, believing in, you know, the unknown. Uh, we do have justice in the empress here. So we have the goddess of abundance, wealth and prosperity, and something being made fair, balanced, or equal in your life. So the empress is lavish abundance, nurturing yourself and others. Okay. We have the justice card. Something is about fair, balanced, equal decisions, correction, something being enforced that brings justice to a situation here. Um, now, what, did, what do we have here for Major Arcana Justice coming in for Aries? Libra energy. Okay, the way I've set this up is just, okay. What do we have here for Aries outcome? All right, what do we have here for Aries outcome? Justice and abundance. You're afraid of the moon. There is a two of the earth. You're juggling, maintaining balance, keeping things in perfect balance. Um, 
The Eight of Air. Okay, so there's some fear here. It's feeling like you have no control over a situation. The illusion of being trapped. What do we have here for Aries as the Two of Pentacles? The Lover's Card. So we have something where you can choose to reconcile, heal. It's Archangel Raphael. Carefully weigh your decision. Make a choice that is the best for healing. Why? What do we have here coming in for Aries as the Lovers, the Justice? fear, the self-doubt, there's worry here. Eight of Wands, something coming in all at once, could be messaging, something happening all at once, things speed up for you. Queen of Wands is here. Fire sign Queen, don't underestimate yourself. There could also be a fire sign around you. Somebody is trying to get attention by um, sort of causing a little bit of drama in some way. Like, they do feel bad for what they've done, though. Five of Cups. Like, they feel remorse for something that they've done. Um, they feel like a loss. Like, they miss you. They feel like they've done something and they feel sad about it. They're trying to come in here with the Knight of Water and smooth it over. And you're kind of like weighing your options. Like, hmm, what ways, what is best for me? I think in the, with as the outcome with the Empress, you are choosing to heal yourself. And, you know, there could be someone here who was saying things to you that were annoying or um page of swords could be rude or inconsiderate to your feelings and you're now choosing do i let this person come back in like they're gonna save the day like they're a hero um what are they really offering you are they offering you something real and valid or are they just offering you more mystery and secrets so you don't want mystery and secrets like you don't want that you want Aries is a, a very honest sign you want results so you're here with the two of pentacles like well I've got to you know I've got things going here and this person comes in with a five of cups and a knight of cups so they feel bad about what they've done or they're trying to make it up to you queen of wands could be any fire sign, but this could be your energy too. You feel confident. Knight of Swords. Yes, yeah, so somebody here was maybe quite mean. Quite irrational. Eight of Rods. They come in fast, quick, with a sense of urgency. What is the Five of Cups about here? The Justice. Okay. Somebody wants something to be made right, fair, just, balanced. Why are you two of coin? You're loyal. Okay, you have a coin to offer. You are offering a pentacle. You're loyal. You're real. I feel like Aries can is very real. Um, depending on your Venus placements, you know, how do you present yourself? And maybe you're rising, but I think the sun, you know, you're an Aries sun, you are very honest. Because the warrior doesn't have time to, like, play games. Um, so what do we have here as the Justice and the Empress? Somebody feels like... Three of Swords in the reversal, Queen of Pentacles reversed, Nine of Cups reversed. 
They are possibly jealous of you. Five of Swords was on the bottom. What is the wheel turning as the root? Okay. Okay, so the person around you feels like this is not fair. Something they are going through, they feel like for some reason, like it's not fair for them. And you are in this sort of like self protection energy, you know, valuing who you are. Um, you have a choice over who you want to sort of spend your time with. Page of the air can be innocent, but it can be immature or inexperienced. The challenge is the six of wands. So somebody is getting attention, getting accolades. They come in with water. They feel like they have there's some kind of feeling of loss. You don't want the moon. You feel like someone here with the page of air and knight of air, they may have brought drama into your life. They may have gossiped about you, said things. So now you're like, well, I've got a choice. I don't have to go through this. What is the lovers here? This could be like an ex, somebody coming back into your life. They want to reconcile with you. They want to make it up to you. What is the lovers? Could even be an employer that wants to hire you after they fired you. <laughs> so what do we have here for the lovers? Hierophant and Ace of Coin. Yeah, see, there's someone who wants to make a real commitment to you. A real commitment, either in marriage, relationship, whatever. They want to make a real commitment. The Ace of the Pentacles. An inflow of abundance, a promising business venture, an important contract document. Why does somebody feel five of cups around the Aries? Why do they feel like they lost? Ten of cups, or ten of pentacles. They invested a lot. They paid a lot. There's a lot here. They, they, they miss you. Um, they may have done something. Well, Ten of Pentacles. Why is Aries in a Two of Pentacles? The Four of Water. You kind of want to pass. Like, you're like, I don't want that. Three of Cups, Ten of Cups, King of Wands. Somebody wants to take action. They're coming towards you with passion. They want to celebrate. There is some, maybe someone around you is now doing really well financially. They want to sort of win you back. Ten of Cups is here. An emotional and rewarding emotional life. Material and emotional needs are met. Um, you're kind of like complacent, like four of cups to the two of pentacles. Like I've got choices. I've got options. I don't know. Hmm. That's not an Aries energy at all. That's more of a, an energy of stability, like cancer, Taurus. Why is there justice here? Nine of wands. Somebody won't quit. They won't give up. And why is the lovers here with the Hierophant? page of the earth the sixth of the earth yeah somebody feels like they owe it to you with the three of swords in the world somebody feels like four of wands is on the bottom stability a ship that arrives the fool card and the judgment somebody wants to win you back this is so crazy um they 
didn't treat you right, though, with the Page of Air and Knight of Air. They acted immature. They may have said some things. Um, they know what they did with the Five of Water. They miss your friendship. You are in an Empress energy, though. You're taking care of you and justice. You want things to be fair. The lovers means you are choosing what is best for you or what is best in the situation. Now, this person feels like they can just come back in, riding in on the horse, you know, offering you something to sort of win you back. But they are offering a Ten of Pentacles, which is interesting. So they are offering like the whole, like, I'm feeling like it's like a whole truckload of something. Like they're like here, like they're wanting to offer you like a truckload of something. They have a Ten of Pentacles. They have the maximum amount, but they don't feel happy. They want you back. They want the Aries back because of the fire. Everybody wants the Aries because of the natural fire. Aries is... Um, so Leo is the continuous flame. Sagittarius is the forest fire. <laughs> Aries is the blowtorch. So Aries, you can like turn on a blowtorch and just blowtorch an area and it's done and then you can turn it off. And I feel like that's what Aries is. Like it's a blowtorch for as long as you need it. If you need the blowtorch for a long time, you can use it for a long time, but then eventually it'll run out of fire and you have to replenish. So I think right now you're in a replenish um, energy. You're like trying to replenish the blowtorch so that if you're needed again, I feel like people hire an Aries for that blowtorch energy that they know they can turn to. Um, people want to date an Aries because it's fun. Um, there's energy, you know, it's not boring. The person's not depressed and crying in their soup or crying in their beer about the past and about how they ruined their rat last relationship and Aries will leave. I've left a person at the table. I've been like, I've got to go if they start to talk about their ex because that's a five of cups. Oh, my past and it just didn't work. And you're like, I've got, I'm busy. Like, I don't have time. Like, this is time. And even though it's feelings and Aries, depending on your placements, if you have a lot of water, you may listen to their story, but you're really thinking, where, where do I need to be? And the same goes in an employment situation. Like somebody could sit there and talk to you about something not working or, you know, revenue is down. You're like, well, I've got somewhere to be because like we need to get to work here. So depending on your Mars, like even if you have a Mars in Pisces, you're probably highly intuitive. Um, you know, Mars in Pisces can feel unsupported and um, any a Mars in a water sign. You can be very, very emotional, but you could be ruthless as well. Um, you know, you just don't care if it hurts someone's feelings. Um, the empathy is not really there I think with a Mars and a water but a Mars and a water can also feel misunderstood or unsupported um so this page of air night of air somebody did something here to you recently where they annoyed you they caused you more stress than it was worth they want to come back now and invest they're ready to invest you're like, I've got choices and you're not saying yes. You're not saying no. You're just kind of like, I could, I don't have to. Why is Aries two of coin to the four of water? Wow. It really caused you to doubt yourself or it really caused you to feel stressed out. The ideas that you found out or they shared really caused you to like ruminate or thinking about it why is this person five of cups to the ten the six see they want to give you the pentacle 
to include you in something or to pay you back, win you back, hire you back, compensate you. Um, why is this the wheel? Why is this like the wheel of change? The wheel. <laughs> the wheel. Okay. It could also be that it really hasn't changed very much, but now it, now it is. Um, they haven't changed. The situation hasn't changed. Why are you getting justice here, Aries? Why are you getting justice? Why is Aries getting justice? Oh, the victory, or there could have been a person here that got attention. Um, it is the card of a win. So it is the card of winning and coming out ahead. Victories and accolades. But you're getting justice for the, ac for the accolades. So what is the Empress here about as your final outcome energy? Okay, water energy here. Let's see, what is, it could be a water sign because we do have a water energy reaching out and a page. What is this Empress? The death reversed. Yep, this person wants to, well, you may have changed here, Aries, but you may have gone through an inner change. Um... What is this Knight of Air, Page of Air? Why did they come in like this? They wanted to establish a real connection with you. Three of coin. Okay, that's strange. What is the lovers? Okay, the hangman. Let's see, what is the lovers? Somebody still thinks about you. Queen of coin, king of water, and the reversal. Somebody is really upset. They want to make this connection. They want to make the connection. They want to, you know, King of Water in the reverse is like somebody who's really upset. They could be crying. They could be missing you. They could feel really, really depressed. Um, kind of an unstable energy. Um, why does this page of cups come forward? Four of coin. They can't let you go. They're still holding on. Freedom. What is the six of wands here? The five of pentacles. Somebody misses you or they're lacking. They don't have enough. They feel excluded from your life. They're coming in. Somebody is getting attention, accolades, advertising, putting the information out there. They feel like they don't have you in their life. So they're coming in with a five of cups and six of coin. Now, why are they giving Aries a six of coin? It's one coin. The knight of coin and queen of air. They're coming in slow with this offer, but they are being bitter or s smart or they regret something here. You might be blocking them too. You could be the queen of air blocking, saying no. Why are you eight of swords here, Aries? Okay, so you're an emperor. You're sovereign over your own life here. Um, somebody wants to make it up to you. They want to give it to you. You feel worried about someone in power. There could be someone who is trying to... Um, they're trying to persuade you. Ten of Swords. Okay, what is this Ace of Pentacles that they're trying to give you? <laughs> the Devil card and the Ten of Swords. 
They know they did you. There's someone who like acted inappropriate. They did something wrong. They betrayed your trust. Um, and now they want to come in and give you something to include you again. What is Six of Pentacles? What is it that they're giving you? They want you to, um, they want you to be calm. They're doing something to calm you, like to um, pacify you, Two of Pentacles. You're, they're giving you a choice or an option. They're doing something to solve or fix with the Temperance and the Magician. So they're doing something to solve or fix or maybe... Yeah, I mean, with the magician, they're doing something where they think this this will work, this will fix it, this will this will make it right. Okay. The outcome for you, Aries, was the Empress with the death in the reverse. You may have changed, and you value yourself a little bit more here. Um, you value your health, your wealth, your time. Um, the person is coming in king of the water in the reversal with uh, the six of coin and they're coming in with a five of cups like they want to make it up to you they want to reach out to you however the coin they're giving you is the devil with the ten of swords like they are trying to get you back under their control in some way um, they do have a Ten of Pentacles to offer. So if it's a company, they do have a lot to offer. The environment might be very restrictive or limited. Um, they actually genuinely feel bad, like they want to win you back. So that's kind of interesting. They actually feel a, a loss. So they want to give you something to make up for the loss. This could also be for some people like some kind of lawsuit where someone feels that you did them wrong and they are wanting compensation. They are wanting you to make it up to them. And they are coming in as like a really unstable person because they feel sad and they are those six of coins. They are six of coin. You're not six of coin. You're two of coin. You're like, let me see what I can do. They are coming in, giving you a pentacle, which could be something that they feel is needed to get the pentacle back because they are in a five. So that could be a document. It could be, be like, it could be a letter from a lawyer for alimony or child support like they feel like they need it back from you and they give you an ace but they have a 10 which is interesting so let's see what is this person coming towards Aries well, court what do we have here coming towards Aries a child tried to flip out concern court because <laughs> whatever they give you actually makes you eight of swords like you start to worry poverty marriage coming out of the dark into the light going on a journey The King of Water in the reverse with the Ten of Swords could also be someone who is ill. We have Toil and Labor and Unexpected Income. Occupation. Ah. Ooh. I'm feeling trapped. 
what you don't see is there is sudden wealth here on the bottom sudden wealth is here with a message and a gift you're waiting i think everything is going to be fine for you aries you come into empress and justice and you also come into the lovers you come into the hierophant with an ace of coin there is something of a great value coming towards you here um the death and the reversal can be an internal change as opposed to an external ending it can be you've changed you've transformed you're like the phoenix rising you no longer want to accept someone's offer although they do genuinely feel bad and they are trying to invest in you which is actually a good thing um the problem is they may have done something in the past or they may have done something that felt like a huge betrayal um ten of swords to the devil it's like it felt like the person betrayed you hurt your feelings put you through hell um they may have talked and gossiped and said things to other people in a closed group a small group of people um now they're coming forward with a knight of the water with a king of the water and the reversal they feel so bad but they're giving you one pentacle even though they have a 10 they're like here's 20 bucks <laughs> and you're like what <laughs> um you're like i really don't need it um it starts to like make you concerned or consider like am i doing the right thing here um, but this is what I have for you, Aries. Thank you for watching and I will see you next time.